All right, welcome everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Sorry for the delay. We had a few things, technical glitches when we transitioned between Minecraft all day and then actual the most um, relevant today for me, of course, which is Golf Clash. So um, here we go. Touchdown tournament, hit and chase, advanced rookie. We have two more pro to play later tonight as well. But today, right now, let's go ahead and take care of advanced rookie. We shot minus 36 in this earlier. We're trying to better that. Okay. I don't know how we're going to do it, but that's what we're going to try and do. So let's go. All right, here we go, baby. Let's turn some music on. There we go. Let's clear that. Let's find our display capture on the left side of the screen so we can get the notes up. There they are. Let's move them around where we can get them. And then we go 85% of the notes. And now we can re-adjust again. And there we go. There it is. We're ready. All right. Let's do this. All right. Turn that down a little bit. We can get rid of that. All right. Let's do it. All right. Um, let's take a look at um, where we stand. We're in 97th place currently. We started with a 17, which is pretty solid. We got three and nine as the Eagles. We had missed two, five, and eight, which were all the par threes. You can imagine that when you first go through a qualification, you're not really adjusted in. We then went to an opening, and then we missed two at the beginning. We made six, made everything else for the, I believe that's 18 under. And then on the back, we made 18 under, two straight across, which was absolutely brilliant. Yet, we still need to try to make three, six, and nine. So, I mean, there's not much room for improvement here other than two. We have to make that. But then we have to make five, 14, eight, and 17, and then try to improve on the others. So, again, tall task in front of us, but um, let's go, right? Here we go. All right, let's take a look at the notes. 20%, extra mile six. We're going to do the rough bump with a... Titan ball. All right, we got it selected, so let's get into it. Here we go. All right, well, thanks to all of you who are in the stream right now. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Also, anybody who watched Isaac earlier play Minecraft and some other games for about two hours, I appreciate you uh, joining him while I was able to run around, get a few things done, get a shower from my recovery from last night. Sarah and I went to see 80s proof so it's a cover band tribute band to all the 80s music which we all adore and we grew up with and man did we party we had such a great time a lot of dancing a lot of drinking a lot of laughing and um then of course at three in the morning when we finally crashed into bed um eight o'clock came around early right so uh i mean i i slept till 9 30 ish um but uh we got up I did a, a pro stream with Matthew via Zoom internet meeting and was able to shoot a minus 33 in pro, which was uh, just a lot of saves, a lot of, uh, man, there were a lot of ups and downs he and I went through on that morning round, but we got it done and we were extremely, extreme, I was extremely grateful for um, him being there and walking me through the ups and downs after being completely on a hangover trying to recover. Um, it was kind of funny. We just laughed the whole time. So we had a great time. But now today is the day. 2.4 here. We want to go after 38, 39, or 40. All right. Great start right away with a perfect ball. All right. We'll take that easy little putt up the hill for an eagle. Now, I have not said hello to anybody in the stream yet, so let's start there. K 
Killin, what is up, brother? Good luck. Thank you, sir. Thank you for being here. Alex, again, thank you for being in Isaac stream and thank you for the good luck. Yeah, minus 40. Let's go. I would love to be able to get that done. Now, are we going to? I'm not sure. I mean, there's an opportunity to do it. Let's see if we can. Anton's in the stream. Yes, sir. Let's go, baby. Let's get her done. Uh, opportunity there for my opponent missed. Mr. Great Shot, best of luck. Thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, Jason, thank you, man. I appreciate it. Thank you for being here. Thank you for the good luck. Yeah. I mean, we'll get Isaac into uh, streaming here and maybe get his own channel and he can just bust out the uh, the games and uh, hopefully he'll, uh, he'll enjoy that, right? Something that obviously, I mean, he's already extroverted as it is, but I mean... Keep him going in that direction, become a leader, uh, become confident in yourself, etc. So those are all the attributes that we are trying to teach him as he gets older and as he goes through life because other people aren't going to look out after you, right? So uh, we're responsible for that. So Steve Passion's in the stream. Yes, sir. I can't stay, but I wanted to thank you for being so awesome with your golden notes. My rookies went 34 and 33, and that's with a missed putt and ball in the water double gold brother you're welcome steve congratulations my friend you don't know how how heartfelt that is when i hear that and just thank you thank you thank you and great job on uh, replicating the notes hitting those great perfect shots and sorry you had a couple misses but you know what you're in gold banner position, so congratulations. Justin Hammert's in the stream. Yes, sir. Welcome, sir. Thank you for being here. Wrench, what is up? Hey, you doing? Uh, Logan, thank you. Couldn't even remember your name, man. Uh, how you doing, brother? Thank you for being here. Yeah, we're going to do this stream. Then we're going to do two pro later tonight. We're going to kill those as well. Oh, nice. Some guy that Tommy is streaming. <laughs> Love it. Steve, Jason, good luck in the move. Yep, great. Max Ford's in the stream. Yes, sir. Let's do it. Thank you, brother. 40 mins yesterday and stream today. Still have no clue what Minecraft is about. Uh, me either. <laughs> I have Tommy on TV muted and Hank on the PC with volume so I can chat. That a boy, Anton. Well done, well done, well done. Well, I'll try to uh, not um, overshadow Tommy in any way, right? I think... Uh, there's room for both of us, him and Masters, and of course, me in advance, Rookie. So we should have a good time. We also have, um, it's the weekend, right? So what do we have? That's right. We have the Masters gear on, right? Because champions, right, are made. And then you get to don the yellow emblem and the green jacket forever. So that's what we're going to try and do today. All right, what do we got here? I don't even know. I'm rolling in here and I don't know. All right. Thank goodness we're not first. Okay, we're going to go Goliath here. We're going to go four and a half top. We're at 10% max adjustment plus 0 0.1, 0 0.1. So we'll aim that up the, um, up the seam and uh, see if we can't make it. Now, what I have to remember here is I can't have it too far up in the fairway up there because if I do... Um, in pro, it bounces forward and stays on that seam to the outside right. Here, I'm, al I'm allowed to get away with the um, the yellow cutting the rough line there, and uh, it usually takes the right uh, the right angle in that funnel. So, let's get to it. Uh oh, somebody got uh, timed out already. Gotta love it. Four five max plus one is two point eight. I almost I almost held on to that too long, but we did get the perfect. Let's see if we can come up that seam and get in. No, we're gonna miss it. Oh, that's what I was afraid of. Because when I miss it, 
I miss it right that exact shot right there. It jumps forward and stays on that outside seam and does not come back on that funnel enough. So um, that's unfortunate. <laughs> yeah, Anton, right? No, I mean, this is the, uh, um, I just never started the, um, with the Marlins, um, or the Quasars or anything like on, on this hole. What I've always done was use the Goliath with the, uh, with the Titan Ball. And it just was a normal, um normal shot for me it would go in and when i found that was the the best adjustment right away in that qualifier or working through the notes i just stuck with it i've seen um in uh like pro we use the uh katana and the sniper and do it that way and it goes in every time um it just seems as if in the uh, rookie you can use a marlin and the sniper and that gives you um one top quarter you know a little bit to the left and you can make it as well i um like i said just got used to this adjustment with the titan ball and the goliath and i just have stuck with it and unfortunately i've uh missed a few times so what we have to do now is uh just do our best that's all and if we don't shoot 36 we don't shoot 36 it's not a big deal right if we shoot 32 it's 32 if we shoot 25 it's 25 we're gonna have fun doing it and that's all there is to it nice anton <laughs> i never hit miss if i hit perfect that's funny all right two and one here at max four four 10 max is 2.6. And then a little bit of overpower to get it there. Perfect release. Hmm. That uh, a wind push from that angle, a little bit, a uh, little bit much for me there. Oh yeah, good game. Sorry, I didn't, um, I didn't know he went first. All right, so this is pretty much the same thing. Titan ball, dude. I haven't played. It feels like I haven't played rookie in like a week. Weekend update, minus 20 on the second shot. Aim to the right of the stick in the hole. We're going to go Titan. Yep. Well, if we can get the three here, we can make up for the, um, the birdie on two. So let's go ahead and do that. So on this shot, pretty straightforward. We're going to go one and a half backspin. Three left spin, 317 to 321 is that number we're looking for. Once we do that, we'll then go ahead and, um, like I said, go the minus 20%. We're going to aim to the, what is it, right of the stick within the hole and see if we can't uh, get a drop. So one and a half and three. It's good right there. Three five at 10% max is 1.9. That's a nice straightforward adjustment here. Right there. No overpower. Released it perfectly. And then what we'll do is go ahead and put on the minus 20, get that ready. So that should be about 320. 318, that's perfect, right in there. All right, so second shot, we're gonna go ahead, sniper rough bump. We are gonna go about one and a half, maybe two at most top spin. Go about three right spin, and then aim to the right of the stick, but inside the hole still. 
and then we are going to make our adjustment at minus 20 and I believe that'll be mid ish and we'll go from there 317 is mid 322 is min so at 318 so we'll be right around mid adjustment see if we can get this to drop in really nicely whatever you shoot right now is going to be a gold band I don't know about that we're not even gonna look brother nice Anton that is some awesome shooting brother 32 34 and a 35 it's awesome how about you only have uh, two golds coming <laughs> and you shot 32 34 35 that's insane what do we say aim right of the stick in the hole 3.8 minus 20 mid is 2.7 oh my god no way how come I miss it every time over here and then it does this exact shot every time Again, all I'm going to say is the following. When you consistently miss with a great ball where we hit it 95, 97% of the time perfect, and you release at the exact same time you always do for that needle speed, and it comes up short every single time, there is a, a needle difference. There's a variance in that needle that they've put in on certain holes. And that's the way they stratify this game to make it that much more difficult. So, I mean, it's... And the funny thing is, go in. There you go, Eagle. Very nice. Or Albatross. Thank you. Well played. That way I don't have to chip it in and get all... Um... I'll take that, Eagle. That's easy. All right. <laughs> I won the Albatross, but... Hey, we don't have to go to a shootout. I don't have to go, you know, be worried about making that little chip down that hill. Everything's great. Let's move on. Nice albatross. Well done. Thank you. Let's move to the next hole. And then we got Berserker. 10%. Two top, full right. A little bit of overpower. A little bit of baby curl. Get it on the green. And, um... Chip it in, put it in, and let's move forward. Yeah, Jason, you're probably right. You're probably right. And then Anton says, um, somehow I got a minus 24 on my third account and didn't make the weekend. Ouch. Anton says, no, 34 in the opening round, only got two accounts to the weekend except my 26 baby. Okay, I got gotcha. you. Two of the three made it to the weekend. The first one only got 24. I got gotcha you and didn't make it. Okay, so you're getting two golds. All right, so, hey, that's all that matters. The two that went to the weekend are going gold, gold, and that's awesome. Congrats. I love how they put... The tree's in a perfect position. The rough in the perfect position. This game is amazing. These developers, they know exactly what they're doing. I'll tell you that right now. They know exactly what they're doing. All right. 2.7 at max 10. 1.6. <laughs> I 
that's the one place you can miss it and still have an easy shot at. That's why I was laughing. I'm like, at least I missed it to the left this time because this morning in my pro account on this, the back nine, right, which was 13, I, I hit it great right into the lake off my tee shot, which then, of course, caused me to get a par, right? Then we did a great job of buckling down, concentrating the rest of the round, and still made 33 in pro. But wow, I mean, it's just a difference. I mean, when the alcohol wears off and you get a little bit more hyped up and um, you get a shower and your senses are awake, yeah, it's a little bit more um, realistic of uh, tense. Right, I'm tense right now. I'm tense because I want to do well, and I'm. I feel like I'm pressing a little bit, but you know how it goes. It's the way it is. This is a tough one right here off this little hill. Min is point seven. Oh, that just is such a small move. So. Like right there. There you go. That's a really delicate shot right there with that little hump right there. You got to go up and make sure it comes down fast enough. Sometimes it stops. Sometimes it goes too fast. So we got it. All right. Moving along, baby. Moving along. Yeah, Anton, for sure. And yes, Killen, absolutely unforgiving for sure. Absolutely it is. All right, we still have to make one up somewhere, which we haven't uh, got to make up two. So now five is such, it's perplexing. It is perplexing. So one and a half back. Max 20 minus two right. with a katana ball. All right, let's do this. All right, let's have some fun. Hey, Sonic Lover, how you doing, sir? I don't know when. Uh, uh, Christian stream got um, put back up. I, like I said, I was doing some things, was getting ready for my stream. I had Isaac streaming uh, Minecraft, and then I had to get all of that switched over back over to Golf Clash. So here we are, and um, upgrade the M. No, not gonna do it. Not till I go to pro with this account, which is gonna be soon, right? How many games we got on here? 1900 games we got to go to pro so once i go to pro i'll take it in with an extra mile eight this is advanced rookie i just the max i want to take in advanced rookie is a seven and um that's where we're at so we'll just leave that non <laughs> upgradable at this point all right this is what we got one and a half backspin and we got a Aim it through that bottom of that right third. One and a half. And then it goes like right there. Four, five at max is five, two minus two is five. All right, perfect release. <laughs> That's unbelievable. I just can't get it anymore. I was able to get it before, but now I just can't get it to drop. On that, that was the that was the um, opener adjustment right there. One and a half back, and. Um, then we switched to one and a quarter backspin. 
minus 0.2, but oh well, doesn't do it. Hey, Brad, good to see you, brother. Thank you, uh, Costa Spray. <laughs> good to see you, brother. Yeah, it's a tough hole. I mean, when we shot 36, we made it both times with that adjustment, which was one and a half back minus 0.1, but then we didn't make it since then. So, hey, Corey. Thank you, Corey. Good to see you. Cora Mailbox, nice to see you as well. Thank you all for being here. It is what it is, folks. We could still make a make a game of it. Just got to get our thinking caps on here. That's all. Thinking caps on. Hey, Brian Heath, good to see you, man. We are shaking it up, my friend. We're rolling, right? Rolling. Doing our very best. Sheriff Twinkie. Always watch your videos back. Shot 35 with your guide. Oh, man, that is awesome. Congratulations on the 35. Does that put you up at the top? Um, and welcome for the first time in the stream. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Excellent, excellent. So we don't have our eagle one two three eagle anymore as first timers. So what we're going to do is we're going to welcome you with so what? Welcome so what? <laughs> That's our new uh, welcoming uh, platform until we uh, until we get a new video, which I'm working on right now, actually. All right, four and a half, ten plus point one. So three seven at plus at ten percent is two point two plus one is two point three. So we'll just go right here. One two three. And perfect. That's the exact same spot I missed it the first time, right on that edge. Hmm. Weekend round adjustments, folks. Thanks. Good luck, sir. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So we have two blemishes on the card already which is not what we want at all so we have need we need to make this one here which um, we can so we're gonna go Titan ball we're gonna switch from the katana to the Titan ten percent still good on the tee shot So what we're going to do here, we can go ahead and um, adjust, push back to max, and then the bottom of the power circle and a touch of overpower is appropriate on this tee shot because of the wind value. And uh, we can get it out to that. Anywhere between 366 to 382 is the number, which is, uh, which, which is workable for all of our clubs. So 3, 1 at 10 is 1.7. I'm going to move that over to there like that. One seven. Move it out here like that. A little bit of overpower. Perfect release. Could have used some more overpower if you wanted to get it out further than this. This should be in that 370 probably range. Yep, 378, which is um, at 375 is mid, at 382 is min. So we'll have to take a look at it. It might be close. But the weekend adjustment is 0% elevation here. Let's see if we can't make it. 
All right. Goodbye, uh, Sonic Lover. Thanks for being uh, stopping by. Gilberto, good luck. Thank you, sir, for being here. Nice to see you. For qualifying until yesterday, everything was fine with my notes, and then suddenly today, one account, nothing was correct anymore. Oh, no. Don't I know that feeling? Yeah, they always keep us on our toes, Brian. That's for sure. That's the difference with those real good players and us that are semi-good. I don't know about that, brother. I don't know about that. So that's Min. Wow, that's Max. That's Min. So, man, we'll, just, we'll play it at mid. Five and a quarter. Right there. Four, five at mid is 2.0. Boy, that rings pretty far up there. All right, perfect. Hmm. That three extra yards that we went instead of 375 was a little bit further that made it maybe about, what, 40% club? You know what I mean? So... If you go ahead and go three seven, I don't know, I may have gone off max instead of mid. I don't know. Ah, I don't know. It's probably just a inappropriate adjustment on my part. Like I said, man, it just doesn't feel right today. This account, which is fine. I mean. I'm just gonna go around, make eagles and and birdies, and you know, get through the the, the account, and see what happens when we uh, when we finish up. So, I think it's their attempt to make it more an even playing field. I agree. Hey, Takashi, nice to see you, my friend. Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right, Cora, very good, sir. I'll see you later, hopefully. <laughs> How do I have a rookie left? I had a lot of things to do yesterday, right? So I did, uh, what, four yesterday, and then I'm going to do four today, right? So three pro and one rookie. So this is the rookie. I already did one pro, so that'll be two. I'm going to do two more later here this early this evening, and then uh, that'll be that. That'll be the weekend. We will be done. I actually have one baby one that's left that I could do, but I'm not going to do it. We'll just let that uh, finish in 100th. I shot uh, 34 on that one, right? So, um, and that's with an extra mile five, um, a junglist four, a hornet one, um, razor two, uh, Malibu four. Um, do I even have a sniper on that account? Like Sniper 2, I mean, it's it's crazy low. But hey, still super fun, right? It's a game, man. It's a game. Four and a half. All right, so. Right there. Three, four, ten, max plus one. So 2.1 is supposed to be the number here. Let's see what happens. All right, it's dead center perfect. Oh, this one's going in. Yeah, I can make it there on the shootout, right? But, um,. I don't know why I didn't make it on the, the first tourney hole. That doesn't make sense. Good luck, sir. Takashi says, uh, anyone see Dan 39 in Matt? Oh, wow. That's amazing. 39. That's awesome. Woo. 39. That's brilliant. 
God bless him. All right, seven. This is the one that's uh, another must make and can really come up to bite you in the you know what if you're not careful. So let's be careful but aggressive. Carefully aggressive. Oh no, his eight whole 18 lipped out for the minus 40 albatross. Oh my gosh. Wow. 28 is in pros all you can manage, Brian. Okay, well, hey, you know what? I was only at 28 and 29. I had, in these three accounts, I went 28, 29, 30. That was the best I could do. But then this morning, for whatever reason, seemed to fall in place and I was able to shoot 33. So that put me in a good position for that bracket. And um, hopefully that will hold. And then what's more important is hopefully I'll be able to replicate that, if not better, I've left a couple out there, um, into uh, tonight's accounts. And uh, we'll see what happens. Yeah, they always go in the shootouts, right, Takashi? <laughs> oh, shoulder aching. All right, so we do three and a tick and all over. Five one at max at 10 is 2.9. That is a big wind adjustment. All right, one 2.9 is all the way out there. Okay, perfect release. Bounce over the edge of that of that rough. No, that's going to stay to the left. It's going to go all the way to the back of the green. Well, no, it's not. It's going to stay to the left, and it's only going to be two squares from the hole, which I really want to make this hole in one one time, just one time, but it just isn't working right now. I can't get it over there close enough to get it at the right angle for it to come in and hit that funnel from left to right. Because if you if you push it over further to the right, number one, you then put yourself in harm's way of flying it directly into the bunker, number one. But worse off is that at that angle, you're then going to possibly bounce it too far to the right and it's going to go into the rough and then either get caught up in that rough and then you have a really tough berserker um, rough bump um, into the green. So I've just learned to take what I can get. This little four footer for Eagle is money. So that's good. Oh, yeah, no, I have a torn rotator cuff and I need to get it fixed, but I'm too stubborn to go get it fixed. So what do I do? I just take Advil for it or a leave and then I say to myself, ah, it'll go away. It goes away for a while and then it comes back a couple of days later and then I'm back to aching and like, oh. All right, here we go, hole eight, Marlin ball. What we're gonna do is um, one top, one right. We're gonna go min adjustment at 10% and then we're gonna add 0.1. So a zero power ball, 10%, one top, one right. We're gonna go min adjustment plus 0.1. Oh, there we go, look at that. I'll move me up there like that. There's the, this is the wrong adjustment, of course, because um, this is a rough bump when we first started. And um, unfortunately, that rough bump turned out to be significantly inconsistent. So we moved out of that and we've gone to the Marlin ball. So we'll take that down so you don't have to watch that because that's not going to give you any type of uh, good information. So we'll just do it this way. Half the red ring, 
one top, one right. And then 2.8 min is 2.3 plus one is 2.4. Okay, dead center perfect shot. Let's go. Camera angle. Camera angle. Boom. All right, there we go. That's what you need right there. Just that easy, folks. Just that easy. Easy shots that you don't have to think about. All you have to do is line it up and hit a perfect shot, and it absolutely tracks right to the hole every single time. Hey, because of your travels, do you have satellite radio in your truck? I would love to listen to some podcasts on the way to Phoenix, but going to have to get a serious subscription. I do not, Jason, and here's the reason why. What I do is I put on Golf Clash, right? I'll go back and listen to my um, my streams and try to hear what I did wrong um, verbally, what I could do better. I try to improve, obviously, on my content and you know just continuing to engage the conversation with the individuals in the stream and come up with different ways to keep it entertaining so to speak and um try to you know count how many times i swear and make fool of myself <laughs> and then of course after that i get bored of that i'll then go and watch other people's streams re-watch streams or i'll listen to um you know sports um, and then I'll listen to Fox News and how they're, you know, they trash Trump and they make fun of Pelosi and stuff like that. So it's always fun. So it's a, it's a bunch of stuff. And then most of the time I'm on the phone talking to the field representatives, the managers, my boss, my peers, um, doing business. So, all right, 10% berserker. Here we go. Get rid of this first, this pin chest. All right, let's read the notes here on the left-hand side before we start. All right, 10%, we can go ahead and we call it a no-move tee shot because we just move it over there. We go full top, three right, and then we kind of, you know, twiggle it so where it's going to go right down the middle. And then if you have four point something or more greater wind, we then just leave it right in the middle of the power circle, dead center, and then we release on perfect. If you have it in the three mile an hour wind, you can pull it down to the bottom of the power circle and release it. But uh, if you have anything in that four mile an hour wind, you either back it up by a ring and then go normal power or you underpower it um, without moving it. So it, it's very critical because I've seen Matthew dunk it in the lake. I've dunked it in the lake, in the qualifiers that is, until you get used to the winds. And that's why you see on the left here, it says watch for 4.8 mile an hour wind. Last night, our last account, we had 5.1 mile an hour wind. So, you know, they absolutely throw these different winds in there. Look, 2.6, right? I mean, that's considerably different than 5.1, which we had last night. It's insane. And then we hit perfect. We go ahead and pull it down a little bit. Not too much. Get it all the way down there. Shoot it out. And we're looking for, I think, 384, 383, 382. 383. Perfect. That's a good number because that gives us min sniper. And we're going to go minus 15. And we're going to add one at 384. So that's good. So minus 15 and add plus one at 384, okay. So add one plus one. So the question is, do you, I should have known this, um, I, sh I didn't put this down, is when you're in your rounds, you need to take these type of notes is, okay, if it's minus 15 plus 0.1, why is that? When you first missed, was it to the left, to the right? So obviously if we add one, it's 
you mean it you you're adding additional ones so you're pulling it more to the right so that's probably what we're doing so full right right there two seven at mid right or is it min i don't even know i can't see it min 1.9 to 2 all right let's see I think I'm gonna miss this to the left because I think I needed to put it out to the right hand side of the hole well look at that all right so Minus 15 at plus one, that missed to the left. So I'm gonna type in here, aim to right inside of cup. So close, so close, and that's what you get. Just another eagle. Oh, so frustrating. Just not dropping. That adjustment is money, just like the two. I never miss hitting it perfect. Yeah, nice, Anton. Exactly. Two and eight are money for sure. <laughs> Kobe Bryant, I love it. He's uh, he's a bigger star than I am, that's for sure. And um, he, I bet, was an amazing individual to know and to watch and to be mentored by right because um anybody who's that amazing at their craft it would be an amazing mentor to have for sure three seven at 10 plus one 2.4 All right, there it is. That's really funny. I can make it every single time, but for some reason, when it's tournament hole, it doesn't absolutely, it just doesn't, I don't know. I don't know what goes to my head. I miss it for whatever reason. It's really silly, really silly. It's the exact same adjustment on every shot and I can't make it in the tournament. And then, of course, that sets up your whole entire round, right? Instead of going 2, 2, 2, 2, 2, which is 10 after 5, you're now 2, 1, 2, 2, 1. And it's like, ah, brutal. Yeah, Tucker Carlson. Yeah, Takashi. Awesome. Oh, Brad, <laughs> he dropped in the lake at 4.4 .4 miles an hour. <laughs> Oh, oh, anything at four, anything at four, I automatically, my, um, I'm on high alert for sure. High alert. What'd we shoot? 16. How about that? That's so funny. It does. It felt like a 12. That's so bad. We're going to all twos except for two and five. Didn't get three, six or nine. Ugh. Ugh. All right, let's uh, let's get back to one. Let's go ahead and get our um, Titan ball and ready to go. Twenty percent plus six yard marker. You know what I might do here? I might go two top spin, full right spin, but just squeak it up to plus seven yards. And see if I can't um, keep it online. Oh, you know what? Shoot. All 
Ah, oh, I don't have my phone. Ah. Somebody sent me a rock shot, rock six, and uh, they made a hole in one with it. And I mean, oh, I don't have a rock in any of my bags anyway, so I couldn't even switch it. I would, darn it, if I was thinking, we could have used the rock here. Two plus seven, just two and all over. You shouldn't do this ever in a, in a game when, you're, when you've already had your adjustments. You should never do this. I'm telling you. Never make these type of new adjustments in the middle of a tournament. Don't be stupid like me here. 1.7. Alright, still perfect though. Let's see what happens. <laughs> oh my if that was just another two inches to the right that may have even though it was going 100 miles an hour if it could have hit perfectly square into that stick it may have been able had a chance to go in the hole so more than likely would have just banged off and went to the left or to the right and trickled down the hill. But that was super close. What is up, Keith? Uh, Keith, Captain, what's up, brother? Yeah, Archer, I'll have two more to go after this as well. Thank you for being here, brother. Good to see your name. Thank you for being here. Look at Takashi dropping hole number one for the Alba. Congrats, sir. Congrats. Hey, Ricardo. Good luck, my friend. Thank you, sir. My coach, my mentor, my man, Ricardo Brown. Oh, Anton played with a Quasar. Nice. Why can't anybody who's down here in Rookie just... Why can't you, when you've played 5,284 games, you only have a 51% win percentage, why can't you just forfeit? I have an 83% win percentage. Come on, man. The likelihood of me not winning is going to be small. <laughs> oh, I'm just screwing. With him. So that's going to be nice. Oh, it's going to stop right up there. Usually, if you get it over another square or two, It'll shoot down to the right and go right near the hole. But uh, he got it up too high. I have a broken fingernail. Picking at it. All right, 20%. Here we go. Let's go. So we're going to go a half a backspin this time. Instead of one and a half. Three point eight twenty max, four point five. So we're gonna go four point nine. So that's good. Four point seven ish, four point eight. Close enough. That's all we're trying to do, get it inside his uh, his range. Pretty good. Luckily, we got past that uh, bunker on the left there. All right. Very good, very good, very good, very good. I'm really, to be honest with everybody, I am sorry, but I am I'm going to take a break after this for about an hour, and then I'm going to come back on for pro. I'm, I'm just really in my back of my head, I'm like, I gotta play pro, I gotta play pro. And I'm like, I'm all fired up for that. Um, this this rookie count is awesome and fun and super, but I'm fired up, I'm serious. I'm fired up for the pro accounts tonight. I really am, I just shot 33 and first. I'm like, I'm ready to go. 
I want to go 33, 34, 35. That's what I want to do. I want to start off with my 33, which is already done. Then I want to improve by 1, 34. Then I want to improve by 2 off the um, first and second ones and get to 35. And I think all three of those at 33, 34, 35 would be in really good position for the weekend. Be done. Great text, guys, and good luck, Kank. Best wish from Germany. Hey, Max, good to see you, man. Thank you, sir, for the, the best wishes, and thank you for the kind compliment about the text guide, sir. Much appreciated. And then there's Caesar. What's up, brother? A big shout-out to the greatest rookie streamer. Oh, man, you are such a nice man. Thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hopefully, if you stick around um, and come back later tonight, you'll see that... I'm a pretty good pro streamer as well. Maybe not the best out there in pro. I'm pretty good though. I can hold my own. It's just uh, rookie. Yeah, it's it's a blast. It is a blast. Yeah, right, Archer. It's not my grandson though. I wish it was. <laughs> That's Sarah's son, Isaac. So cute. <laughs> it's going to turn into, he's like, hey, can I stream again? Can I stream again? So I'm like, sure. I'll go buy lunch. You guys, you stream. I'll take a shower and get ready. And then I'll come on after you're done. So he loves it. Just, just loves it. He's a ham, right? All right. So this is an actual tournament hole here. So we got to pay attention. Four and a half. Four one ten. Two point six. All right, here we go. Just that little adjustment, right? And the adjustment I made from the first, or hole number two to this hole. Good luck, thanks. Um, I just, I pulled it back just a teeny bit, and then what I did was I left it to the left center of the pin, if that makes sense. So instead of going directly at the pin, I just tweaked it just a, a hair to the left. Um, because I was hair to the right each time on uh, all my other shots when I missed. It was missing to the right, so we tweaked it to the left. Hey, Mr. Great Shot, thank you, sir. Oh, thank you, Archer. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> That's awesome. Maybe it's, because it's the confidence. I don't know. Whatever, <laughs> right? <laughs> all right, I think we're ready here. We don't even have to put anything in. Among the best pro streamers as well. Thank you so much for your help for this. Thank you, Caesar. You're the best, man. Thank God. I love you, brother. <laughs> I'm a monster. I just don't want to change the balls, man. It's just easier to do it this way, right? One and a half, three. Looking for 317, 318. Move it right to there. 3-6 at 10 max is just a nice little even two rings. Those are the best adjustments, right? When they're just not even and you don't have to worry about it. Pull it pretty quick. And perfect. Release. All right, let's figure this one out. All right, so this one Weekend update is minus 20% aim to the right of the stick in the hole. Okay. Well, what we did last time on this, we hit it to the great right and we had to uh, have our opponent make the albatross. So all we had to do was take a very easy given eagle. So this time we cannot hit great right based on where our um, landing spot is. It's too far to the right on that collar that fairway and if you miss it great right but like we did it bounces right into that fairway and just takes off past the uh, 
past the green. So let's do a better job this time. Al, what's up, brother? There's Leonardo Del Toro. You are by far my favorite streamer. Such great content. Minus 37 in his rookie. Yes. Dude, people, that is awesome. That that just makes me so happy. It's unbelievable how happy that makes me. All right, so that's not going to be enough. Two seven men is one point seven. Hey, I left it on purpose. I held on to it to make sure it was a perfect shot instead of great. And then, of course, what do we do? We just we skim the right edge, so it doesn't matter. Still get an eagle. Gosh darn it! I wish I had another account to play to um, take that tweak and make it. Oh wow, that's a hard hole. Three. I've never made. I I made three a couple times, but on great balls, <laughs> I've never made it on a perfect ball. I tore it up. I thought it was your son. Oh, Ricardo. No, that's uh, that's Sarah's son. 20%. I've been playing zero. Yeah, I miss, I, uh, you know, zero probably works as well, right? Like in pro, it was like a 25% from Fenzel's notes and then I tried it once wasn't even close so I put it to zero and then I made it so I mean it's really different for your I guess your your clubs the ball you're using as well as the wind um, your landing spots so I mean it takes a lot of things into consideration so all right at least we got one back so far on the back side so 16, if we can squeeze through with an 18, that's 34, pretty straightforward. I would love to go unblemished plus. So what unblemished means is all twos across the board and then maybe get six and nine to drop. And then that would be, um, that'd be 20, right? So 20 and 16 would be 36. Th those are the things I think about when I'm playing the game. I'm like, boy, it'd be nice to go clean all the way through. But that's how it is. Oh, look at Anton's. Dropped it at zero, playing zero percent. He's dropped it a couple times. Nice. Very nice. Very nice. You know, it would be nice to have the notes from everybody put them all together and then it work on every hole right and then shoot like 39 or 40 or something like that right but um not every club from every person out there in the community who's you know saying hey i made this i made that not everybody has the same clubs right and they don't have the same balls so it's difficult. Like on four and seven, I use a berserker with an extra mile seven, right? And then you have certain, you know, adjustments you have to make. Not everybody has those clubs and those balls and those adjustments in their bag to be able to get it done. All right, so this is two and a half and one. That way you don't have to overpilot so much. 2.3 at 10 at max is 1.4. Okay, let's take a look. Here we go. Hmm, that's about right. 
Yep, good luck. Tell you what, man. I'm not even paying attention. I don't I didn't even see that guy shoot prior to me. That's really bad. All right, four, 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 four. Berserker. Thank God for Berserkers. And thank God for the golden shot. You know? A free golden shot to get nine Berserkers. Oh, how can you ever pass that up? All right, here we go. Oh, I think I got a four or five times times across three accounts. Wow. So if you had three accounts times two, four, six, you got it almost 80 some percent of the time. That's amazing, Anton. Oops, sorry. I can't read the chat and play golf at the same time. All right. Why did we not put the Berserker on here like I thought we had? Wow, 5 1 here? Wow, this is a big wind here. <laughs> That's in the water. Oh boy. This is what happened to my pro account earlier today. I made a um a par on this hole on the back nine because I did the exact same thing. Used a berserker, hit a great right, and went right in the lake, and then uh couldn't recover. Hit a great left again on the second shot, and then it was in the rough, and then I couldn't uh recover from the rough iron shot, so par it was. Mm -mm, good. I don't care. Four, eight, ten, max. Ah, eh, we'll say two point one between max and mid. Mm -hmm. so it's a lot easier to try to chip it in from back there than it was next to these trees over here on the left where he's shooting from because when i hit my second shot uh in my pro account i was over way over here so Why not try the old big topper shot <laughs> and try to hit the rough? But obviously, I had too much overpower on it, too much top spin, and all that good stuff. But it's one of those delicate shots that you have to uh, hit perfect for it to turn out. So here we go. Let's see if we can make a recovery shot here. All right, four nine at min is just 0. 0.6 so 0. 0.6 would be like right there and hit it perfect there it is all right not bad not bad little birdie out of it lost another one on uh on the card but still you know when you dunk it in the lake and you're still able to make birdie that's not a bad thing yeah
Yeah, right, Anton. Too bad it wasn't all those uh, those albatrosses were across multiple accounts, right? Exactly. <laughs> hey, KD, good to see you, brother. Yeah, the ball did get wet. So what? Exactly. I love it. I should be putting that up more often. I just don't do it. All right, two and a half and one. Three at 10 max is 1.8. Let's pull it. Actually, I'm going to do 1.9 instead of 1.8. And we'll see. Mm. Even at 1.8, I don't think it makes it. That's all right. Take that. It's pretty consistent right there, whether it's a Berserker or a Marlin Ball or a Titan Ball. They're all within less than one yard. And that's a pretty good adjustment. I mean, I think the pros would take that, right? Hey, my wedge is going to go 120 yards. And if you're within, you know, one foot of the cup every time you swung, guess what? They're going to take it. Oh, Mr. Greatshaw did the same thing in Rookie twice. <laughs> Thanks, Anton. Appreciate that, brother. Hey, Ashley. Good to see you. Thank you. Thank you for being here. Woohoo! Ashley. Ashley and her broken device. But soon this week, she will be on the war path. I've nicknamed her Ford, Ford Mabel, right? So instead of formidable it's formidable so she is going to be a formidable opponent moving forward with her new device and her new ipad stand and uh it's going to be you know one of those things we have to watch closely all right i gotta make this man i gotta catch up i gotta make five six and nine that's right everybody i gotta make five Six and nine. Five, six, and nine. Where did we miss this last time? We missed it to the right. So 20%. So we are going to go one and a half back. We missed it to the right. So we went 20 and then we went minus two and we missed it to the right. So if we go just max, do we miss it to the left? Was that 0.2 to the left that we missed it? That's the question. These are questions I'm asking out loud, right, to myself. I'm trying to remember, I'm trying to think of the angle it comes in at, right? And then it goes to the right. So since I went max less two, if I go max straight up, let's try that. Why do I have the big dog on? That's why. Three two twenty max three point eight minus two would be really three point six, but I'm gonna go three point eight and we'll see what happens. I'm gonna miss it to the left, I'll tell you right now. Three point eight ish. Perfect. Oh, we got a good camera angle. Got a good camera angle. Got a good camera angle. Kaboom. <laughs> oh, I love when I contradict myself on stream. It's so great. Oh, I'm going to miss this. I'm still going to miss it. Doink. 
That's so funny. It's terrible. I mean, it's a great adjustment, right? It just you got to tweak it back and forth. That was the first adjustment from the qualifier. Then the opener, it went from one and a half to minus point one to point two by the end. Then we made them, and now we're back to in the weekend. You got to go back to the original, which is just one and a half back, straight up max. So how about that? <laughs> That's so funny. Thank you, KD. Thank you, Anton, Ashley, Al, Jason. Thank you all. Thank you, Killen. Thank you all. Thank you all. Thank you all. Well, that was nice to get that, right? So now we're only one down as compared to the front side. So that's good. Now if we can go three, two, two, three, right? We got it. Okay, so now the only thing here is we went 378 last time, right? Which put us in almost like 40% range. And does anybody remember where we missed it to which side? Do we miss it to the right? So that was 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 9, 8, 7, 6. Second shot. All right, so we did 378. So we did mid, mid number here. And that's at four, five at zero. Yep. Four, five at mid zero was just two rings. <laughs> And I think it was too much, to be honest with you. One, two rings right there. And I think we missed it just to the right. Perfect. Mm -hmm. That came in really fast, too. All right, so at 370 eight zero percent minus zero point one there you go that's if we get to 378 again so this is the reason why in, in uh, Tommy meet when I asked hey listen we really need um, better advancements in the replay um, hub so that you can slow down, you can freeze frame, you can stop, you can fast forward, all of that, so that you can help yourself while in game and making plans and making notes and all of that. So that would help us content creators, but also would help everybody in their own game to manage shots and to improve. So, oh, Ricardo says it's minus 10%. <laughs> Hmm. 4.1 is 2.2 at 10. I'm going to have to... Look at that shot, Ricardo. I'm trying to just get to, like... 369 because I know that's a true mid number. I don't want to get to 378. Oh my gosh, it's the same shot. Ah! All right, I'm still going to do it. Now that I know at 377, 378, it's got to be mid minus 0.1 at zero. So, Ricardo. Let me try it, brother. Don't get mad at me if I don't go to minus 10%. All right, pal? <laughs> if you use wind balls, expert is just advanced pro. Oh, he so wants me to go into expert and kill it. I know he does. If it was real cash on the line, that play 
replay technology, you might just be available, but I'm on your side, Mr. Minus 40. <laughs> All right. Three six is one point six at zero, right? Minus one. One six minus one. So one point five. Oh, I left it short. God bless America. You dummy. That was my fault. That was my fault. I left that one short. That was not a glitch. That was not the game. That was not the play demic people. That was me. That was just a complete early release. Just got excited about hitting that and showing off that, hey, listen, watch my adjustment. And it's going to be zero and minus 0.1 and it's going to go in. Well, that's ego for you right there. That'll slap you silly if you let it. Just absolutely silly. Stupid. God bless. Sorry, everybody. Sorry I did not come through for you. So we just have to go 2-2-3 two, two, now, right? <laughs> nice killing. <laughs> Great to the right. I love it. If it was real cash on the line, that replay time would you want might be available. No, you're probably right. Absolutely right. You're absolutely right. Four and a half. Three point eight, ten percent, two point four. That's unbelievable how smooth of that needle speed is on this hole as compared to how slow and glitchy it is on the hole before, which is hole six. It just stops. Ah. I'm telling you what, I don't even know why they make you play shootouts when every time you're in the shootout, you make the hole in one. They should just say, okay, the algorithm reads, he's made it 99 out of 99 times. We're just giving it to him. <laughs> All right, Anton. Thank you, brother. Thank you for stopping by. Um, maybe you can stop back for the two pros later tonight and uh, see whether or not I can uh, kill it over there. Yes, Jason, I'll make sure that it's up on the pro rounds later. Um, I think I um, had to disable a bunch of stuff just because of... Um, Type something in there now. I don't know if it's going to work, but what I did was um, I turned it off and I turned it back on. Maybe that'll that'll help it. I'm not sure. Or I can actually probably type something. Nope, not coming up. I don't know why the... Um, Why it's actually not working. There's the chat box. Properties.
Hmm. Sorry about that. All right, seven. What did we do here last time? What did we do here last time? What was seven? Oh, we made the uh, the eagle with it being about two squares past and two squares to the left. At 10% berserker ball. Here we go. Clear this out real quick. Let's do this. Well, I don't know if it's working on my end either, Jason. He can see it in the um, YouTube. He can see YouTube uh, chat. It's just not coming up on my screen at this point. What I'll have to do is um, go ahead and um, I'll have to delete it and then uh, bring it back up. Three point oh at ten is one point seven. So we go three and then one point seven. Ah, that great ball. I think I might be able to get away with it. Nope. Oh, my God. Really? Oh, so bad. I'm going to have to get some coffee before I come on later for these pros because I am just lethargic. I'm tired. It is um, really weird. Hard to be perfect every time. Hey, I know Keith right in the sand, baby. I thought maybe that... Um, that would stay to the left and give me a, a pretty decent chance at the recovery eagle um from the fairway but not to be my friends not to be so now we have a berserker from the sand and somehow try to recover that look at this it's just hilarious I'll just try mid at All right, so now we've put ourselves in a position where we made the hole in one on five to recover from the front side, right? So now we gave that one back here on seven. So now we have to go at least two, two to go 16, 16, or two, three to get to 33. So again, we shouldn't be looking ahead. We should just be worrying about what we're doing in front of us right now. 
and then uh, take each shot as it comes. But, you know, we're all human beings when we do this, right? No time to make sandcastles. <laughs> How's that, Jason? <laughs> I'm just tired. Like I said, I need to go get, I'm going to ring up a, a, a pot of coffee here. I'm going to drink a nice, large, hot cup, and then uh, we'll go from there. You know what? I think I've hit that shot out of the five accounts that I played this time. That was the first time I hit it great this whole week on that, uh, on that Berserker curl shot. So... Jeez, oh man, five times, five times five qualifiers is five, then 10 and 20. So 20, I hit it one time out of 25 shots. Great. Everything else was perfect. So, I mean, I'm not really, I can't be mad about that, right? The likelihood of hitting 25 perfect balls at 25% overpower with 15% curl with a berserker with an extra mile seven at overpower. I don't know. The stats, right? I'm going to go 2.4 here. Let's see. Oh, it's coming in too hot. Oh, no, it's not. Wow, that turned out really nice. Wow. All right, that works, right? Not bad at all there. Okay, Wally, good to see you, man. Thanks for being here. Thank you for stopping and saying hello. Um, we are not doing very well right now at all. We're currently in sixth at minus 28. So we need to go 32 at a minimum, and that might even not be good enough. Four off the pace of what we did previously. But you know what? Who cares? So what? No one cares. In the big scheme of things, no one cares. It's entertainment, and that's all it is. Entertainment. <clears throat> Half the red ring in the left rough. One top, one right. Minimum adjustment plus 0 0.1. Hit it dead center. Perfect. Let's move on to hole number nine. Forty two hundred games, seventy four million earned, three three um, banners. Just a bit short. Kind of coming in at a, a pretty good line, but just a little bit short. Four, four, ten, men, three point six plus one is three point seven. Perfect release. It was a little left perfect, actually. So if this doesn't go in, I won't be surprised. But 
Look at that, right in the hole. Thank you, sir, and best of luck to you, my friend. Best of luck. All right, that was the one of the two we needed. Now we need to go one more here. Oh, look at this. Not even close to being a winner. Oh, <laughs> beauty. What a beautiful round that is. Seventeen on the front, eighteen on the back. Mm -mm, good. Well, the good news is I'll have the the tiebreaker, right? Because he has thirty-two, I have thirty-six, so fifteen, thirty-two, thirty-two. I have seventeen, thirty-six. I'll have. Yeah, let's just let's bury it for the thirty-three, and then just. Then he can't say, I lost to a tiebreaker. Let's just say that we beat him. That's what we're going to do. We're just going to come out and beat you straight up, brother. Best of luck to you. Now I'm angry. All right, here we go. Here we go. Let's go. Nice archer, 28 after 14. God bless him. That's amazing. That's right. That's what 83% does. <laughs> Just like that. Thank you, Mr. Great Shot. Thanks, Killen. Appreciate that, guys. How come my phone and iPad lag when I try and use the crosshairs overlay? Um, it's just a operating system that uh, causes just a little bit of a slowdown in your actual gameplay. The thing that um, we found out in the iPad Pro, which is the newest generation, obviously, no worries, whatever. Doesn't lag, doesn't cause slowing, doesn't overheat. But in any generation prior to the op uh, iPad, it seems to either cause a glitch or slows your game down. And uh, Matthew had an older version of an iPad. Then he went to the iPad Pro, and the difference was dramatic, he said. So um, it's just a operating device or program thing. So I apologize for that. I am not the manufacturer. Look, 4.3 here. So we're not moving it. And a 4.3 is right here. just inside the regular power ring and look how close that comes perfect get me out into that 382 83 84 range 381 is just as good mm, minus 15 here we go so minus 15 and plus one aim to the right inside of the cup all right I thought we missed it to the right this last time up here doing this, didn't we? Or do did we miss it to the left? Doesn't matter. Min sniper. 15 plus point one, 384. And aim to the inside right of the cup. No, it wasn't you, Scott, and then Killen has a good idea. Take the enhanced graphics off. That might help it a little bit. And then, uh, as Mr. Greatshot says, it just seems when you put that uh, program into that generation, that older generation, it just it acts a little bit differently. I don't trust. I'm going right at it. Three five min minus or plus one, so it's two six. Kind 
Come on, baby. Let's outright, outsmart, and outbeat our opponent. Oh my god. Why did I not just follow my notes where it says aim to the right inside of the cup? If I do that, that ball probably goes directly in the cup. Oh my gosh. Why do I not just read the notes and follow them? I said aim to the right inside of the cup. And I'm like, no, I don't believe that. I thought I missed it to the left, blah, 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 blah. And I aimed it right down the middle and I missed it to the left. So stupid. God bless America. Dang it. So close. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, well, thirty two it will be, folks. Four shy of our best this tournament. But we still have two pro to look forward to and really have a good time doing that. Those, man, there's some tough shots in that in that bracket up there, that's for sure. Nothing's easy. One's hard. Two's pretty straightforward. Uh, three's pretty straightforward. Four, four is really tough. Five, it's a beast, so difficult. Six is straightforward. Seven is so hard as well. Oh my gosh, it's so hard. Eight, you can make that. And then nine's pretty straightforward, so. Two six ten one is one point seven. So it's one point six plus one. And I hit it great, so it doesn't matter. Not even close. It's amazing how far right the ball goes when you hit it just so slightly great to the right it's not even close but it doesn't matter it is so we'll get a silver not a bad deal All right so two five and then Four and seven. So those four got me. Everything else was pretty solid. So we missed one par three, two par threes. That's it. So we got four out of six, which isn't bad. Not bad at all. Screwed up on seven, which we shouldn't have done with a with a great great ball. That's a that's a make. And then Four, we screwed up on a on a great ball, so that's two. And then two, we screwed up on just hitting it too hard. So that's three shots right there. So that's 35. What did he do in the opener? 31. Yeah, we could have got first, but it doesn't matter. <coughs> how many how many games? 17, 18? Yeah, he's a he's a good player. He's a good player. Congratulations, Polly boy. Congratulations. Well done. Mm-hmm. All right, everybody. That is going to be it for now for another, I'm gonna, what time is it? 5.21. So I'm going to come on at 6.30. That's in one hour and nine minutes. I'm going to get, uh, get a coffee, relax, and then uh, come back. Oh, wow. What percentage of players have finished tours 12? I have no idea. <laughs> Jason, that's funny. Jonathan Jones said that summed up his whole uh, his whole round. Is APOC 3 enough to start tour 10? Well, let's take a look. Hold on. 
I'm going to say, um, I'm going to go to Golf Clash Notebook, and I'll tell you in a second. Clubs. All right, extra mile. What extra mile do you have, Scott? So let's say you have an extra mile seven, 234 plus 50. So you have 284 total yards with carry and roll. So 284. Extra mile th or an APOC three gives you 231 and 64. So it gives you 295. All right. So 295 versus 284. So you have more distance with it, right? But the extra mile seven go lands at 234 and the APOC lands at APOC three lands at 231. So that's four yards shorter than the extra mile. And if you take a look at some of these courses and you're playing from the second tee, yeah, uh, you know what? Thor's Hammer might be a better choice there if you have like a Thor's Hammer 5, right? Because it goes 232 plus 67, right? That gives you 299 yards. And uh, that's where it starts to become a, a game breaker um, compared to the other uh, clubs that you might have in the bag. So you have a 6. So it's the same thing because it's both 234. 6 and 7, both are 234 plus 50. So it's 284 for 6 and 7 and uh, 290 five four three but again it all depends what's the accuracy accuracy of a uh apoc three is 43 for the seven it's a 45 so they're both similar in accuracy backspin is 48 and the curl is 47 the curl on the three is 92 and the backspin is 20 though so you're probably not going to be using it for a backspin shot anyway. That's going to be reserved for a Thor's hammer and a rocket so or a quarterback. So if you want the curl to curl shots, then APOC 3 is the, is the club because you get more distance overall if you can land it in the fairway and use the roll. You have similar accuracies, which is 43 versus 45, and you get better curl, which is 92 versus um, 47. So there you go. Yeah. APOC six, you can play whatever you want, right? Yeah. 10 scary. Hey, Jason, I just finished brother. Um, this, uh, this last rookie advanced rookie round shot 32, finished second to a 35. Absolutely awesome player, um, that we lost to. So congratulations to him. And then, uh, give me an hour and we're going to go and play our two final pro accounts for the evening for the weekend. And then that will be it. All right. So everybody for now, we are going to say adios and see you in one hour and five minutes from now for pro. Um, I don't even know which accounts. Uh, Dead Center Perfect Hank and then our Hail to the Gang Hank accounts. All right, guys, gals, thank you so much for being here. See you in just one hour and five minutes.